again in laboratories and we're going to demonstrate three new devices that are going on sale on the Weird Art Things web store. First we have the Nestronic RoboHarp. This is a voice changer built into a old Nintendo Entertainment System cartridge. We're going to turn it on. Okay, okay. Um, You'll see when you get closer, you can just basically hear it's a voice changer through there. Each one comes with a personal broadcast antenna because you'll see if you don't get it far enough away from the microphone, it feeds back. So we're just going to have it up there. These are the actual production versions, so we're going to make sure uh, before they ship out, each one gets sanitized. Sanitized. It also has the ability to turn off the little broadcast antenna. Uh, this is the off switch. And uh, you can go directly out. This is a little mini output jack. On the back we have a main volume button. And we have a mic sensitivity volume. Although I always keep this down to the very minimum because that thing is crazy loud. And the four different buttons we have here, we've got uh, pitch up pitch down and then there's like a robot and some weird bubbly sound so I mark it with a bubble sound this is the little bubble button every single device also comes with a one-of-a-kind drawing that I made so we got that's the Nestronic Robo Harp now let's take a look at the Nestronic Kuzonica the Nestronic Kuzonica another one in the series of the Nestronic series this one's same exact idea voice changer chip Except we're sticking a kazoo at the bottom instead of a harmonica. You turn it on, get your little broadcast antenna at the right height. So you get the four buttons. And then you can turn the speaker on and off. You also have the output function on the side where you can run it into whatever you like. On um, the back, we've got the volume and the mic sensitivity. And then uh, this is, you can see the, the little part where the kazoo sticks out. Let's move on to the third device. The final piece we have is the Merlin Mangler and it's a kid's toy. Uh, I believe it was in the eighties. This came out and it's got one uh, circuit bend on it. It's a pitch bend. It's on the back. It's got this big knob here. And I've marked where is the safe area. If you go past it, forbidden zone over here, you're pretty much gonna crash the system. But it's okay, if you crash it, you turn it on, you turn it off, and it comes back real easy. It also has a speaker on off switch because if you wanna take out the optional hair piece that I have here that comes with it, um, then uh, you can go output to whatever device you like. And you also are going to get a, um, another little accessory, which is a hat, um, a wizard hat, because, you know, it's the Merlin Mangler, and he, he needs a hat. This guy's a wizard. And uh, we'll just bend our minds here. That's mind bending. Ooh, mind, mind bent. There he is. That's the third device that you are going to see on Monday on the Weird Art Things web store. See you there.